Hello there. There were certainly winners and losers with Monday's weather. Morning cloud gradually broke up. And in fact, in Newquay, Cornwall, it was warm enough to venture out to the beach into the afternoon. It was a different story across parts of North Wales and Northern England. In fact, we saw over two inches of rain, 60 millimetres of rain in some places, and it was a pretty dismal day. Now, that low pressure is gradually drifting its way eastwards off into the North Sea, allowing this ridge of high pressure to build. So a much quieter start to the story for Tuesday. There will be some sunny spells as we go through the day. A few scattered showers will tend to develop, particularly heavy ones across parts of southern Scotland and northeast England, maybe with the odd rumble of thunder. But certainly with more sunshine and lighter winds, it will feel a little warmer. Top temperatures possibly as high as 24 degrees, 75 Fahrenheit. Now, as we go through Tuesday evening, we'll continue to see some clearing sky. Some patchy mist and fog will form, some of it uh, dense in places and quite stubborn to lift away. It will be a relatively mild start to Wednesday morning with temperatures widely into the low to mid-teens. High pressure is going to build as we go through the day on Wednesday. So once we've got rid of those misty, murky conditions first thing in the morning, a few scattered showers perhaps across Scotland and northeast England, but on the whole, dry, settled and sunny for most, and a little warmer as well. We could see temperatures peaking at 25 Celsius. That's 77 Fahrenheit. Warmer still as we go into Thursday. A lot of dry, settled, sunny weather once again across England and Wales. Some patchy coast mist and murk may be lingering in the far southwest, but temperatures could peak once again widely into the mid-20s. Maybe one or two spots in the southeast could see temperatures into the high 20s. And that's because we're going to continue to tap into some warmth that's coming up from the near continent. Not the extreme heat that they have been seeing, but certainly as we head towards Friday, we'll see an increasing spell of heat and humidity. But at the same time, it comes with a caveat. As this weather front pushes in from the west on Friday, it could trigger off some sharp and thundery downpours as it continues to track its way steadily east.